They're normally the stuff of science fiction. Android replicas of living human beings who can mimic their flesh and blood twins. But in Japan, one scientific genius has made an android clone of himself. Hiroshi Ishiguro uses his robot doppelganger to teach students at his university. And now he's made an even more sophisticated android, which is being deployed by medical staff in a Japanese hospital. In a moment, we're going to talk to Ray Kurzweil, the American futurist who believes humans will soon merge with machines. But first, this report from North Asia correspondent Mark Willisey. They're identical twins, mirror images of each other from their boots to their bouffant. But one is flesh and blood, the other circuits and sensors. I'm a human, he's an android. Robotics expert Hiroshi Ishiguro is both the creator of and the template for Geminoid HI1, believed to be the world's most sophisticated humanoid. Researching and developing Geminoids is the best way to answer the philosophical question of what it is to be human. This is my main purpose. Regarded as one of the world's top 100 living geniuses, Professor Ishiguro controls his doppelganger remotely often using his twin to teach and sometimes terrorise his classes at Osaka University. It feels like Professor Ishiguro is actually here. It feels like we're having a real class because the atmosphere is serious and tense. These robots could be used as guides at museums or for other jobs like that. In my case, I can use it for my lectures while I'm away overseas. Hello, Australia. Now, Professor Ishiguro's twin has some female companionship. Geminoid F is faster and smarter, packed with more sensors, allowing her to easily mimic the facial movements of her controller. And in her work as a nurse, she's been programmed with a soothing bedside manner. We're putting her in the consultation room at a hospital, and she sits next to the patient like a nurse. We found that people feel at ease just having the robot in the room. In future, having an android alter ego could mean having someone to help us, keep us company, and even allow us to be in two places at once. But some might find having a mechanical mirror image somewhat creepy. But Professor Ishiguro believes that it may help us understand more about each other and even ourselves. It's like my twin. It looks like me, but inside it's different. If I operate the android, it becomes me. Hiroshi Ishiguro's lifelike creations could soon revolutionise the way we look at robots and the way they look at us. Mark Willisey, Late Line. <laughs> 